Hey guys, Swamp Fox here. All right, we Kate and Dell just blew a hole in uh, the ice and found a secret base. Thinking we're this. Radio tower. Means the lab's not far. Come on. Jack, you good? You, you know you don't have to be honest. This is the last chapter, I believe. So hopefully we got all the Jack's upgrades. Sooner or later they'll know who we really are. Getting in there, not with those turrets in place. Generator here. <laughs> Sounds like that did the trick. Shit, we didn't get all of them. Gotta be another generator somewhere. not gonna work. Some answers? More than ready. Well, one big difference between this place and New Hope. They weren't worried about getting found. No fake shipping depot, no front. I have 54 components. Did it respec or something? It did.
me. You're this upset? About a pinprick? I have sensitive hands. Proper identification is required for entry. Your entry has been denied. Good day. A what? Niles? Is that you? Proper identification is required for entry. Proper identification. Hey, you can give it a shot. But it's gonna hurt more than you think. that welcome home? Do you really require an explanation? I think I like the gibberish spouting novels more than this cryptic garbage can. Ah, I see you've met my vastly inferior construct at New Hope. Do keep up. This way, please. What the hell? It's freezing in here. Goodness. Apparently, some of our cryojets are malfunctioning. There must be a fault in our system. You don't say. Of course, we cannot proceed until those cryojets are disabled. What? Ah, shit! I would not do that again if I were you. Miserable little garbage can. Cryojets are probably powered like the turrets. Let's find a generator. Let's get back to that garden. Okay. I'm telling you, she's the emotion that what it was like subject, you know, blah 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 well blah blah. Done. Yeah, Jack's good. I've been meaning to reset those cryojets for quite some time. of an old industrial accident. Tell these tanks. Same as the ones at New Hope. Yeah, I noticed. Ah, yes. My work there began as an effort to cure children ill with rust lung, but it grew into something far more significant. The cog wanted medicine. I gave them gods. Oh, well, water under the bridge. to maintain the integrity of my tour. I do this so rarely. Please, if you will, come this way. Nope. <laughs> and 
that's why. Over here, if you would. Can't have you wandering about unsupervised. Yes, that's it. K is EV1849. 100%. This way, please. I got it, Niles. Just let me upgrade Jack. I don't know why I thought I had enough. clearances for that information. Do let me know when we can recommence our tour. you remain close to me. I am your guide, after all. This next area is quite fascinating. What the hell? The path to every breakthrough is paved with failure. Here are some of our more unstable specimens. This breakthrough of yours, how did you manage it? One of the miners' children, as it happens. She was resistant to aging, disease. We raised her as our own. our tour. Ah, uh, you may find this especially interesting. What is it? Hybrid. Hybrid? You mean a locust? One and the same. In our previous facility, we had problems with genetic stability. The sires were distempered and sterile. A problem for obvious reasons. But the locusts were different. Highly controllable. The perfect soldiers, and blessedly able to reproduce. What made them different? Their cells. You see, the emulsion miners' children provided a marvelous genetic repository, as did the indigenous creatures of the Hollow. In all of your genetic research, it's in here? Of course. Oh, shit. Hey, hey, Jack! Jack, come here! I need you to download everything off this terminal. Oh, man. 
I don't think I want to know what any of these file names mean. But when the extent of one very special child's genetic immunity to emotion became clear, our work began to soar. Please, go ahead. That, of course, is Mira, or as you know her, Queen Mira. You bred her with the sires? Nothing so monstrous. Her stem cells, however, were delightfully complementary to sire DNA. But we underestimated so much. Young Mira's strong maternal feelings, for instance. Let me guess. She led her children to slaughter you all. No, no, no. Well, yes. But I meant her more traditional maternal feelings. For her daughter. Little Reyna. Your mother. What? You're lying. I am not. Your mother was born here, and taken from us by her spineless father, thus causing young Mira's unfortunate rebellion. Why are you telling me this? You have so many gifts, you do not yet understand. Hey, what's going on? He will kill you if he knows. They all will. What did you just say? Hey, hey, what are you... Why did you come here with me? What did J.D. tell you? Kate, I am not gonna hurt you. No? Maybe you should. Or maybe I should. Hey. That would indeed sever the link between you and the Locust. Now, shut up! I won't let them do to me what they did to my mother. Your mother? And what did they do to your mother? In the hive. They changed her. It killed her. I can't. But that is the process that allows them to learn, to grow. Without a queen, they remain unguided. See? See? I'm a weapon. No. You're not. Back in the village, when I was inside that snatcher, I was controlling them. I think I killed Oscar. Wait a minute. It... You think? Or you did? I don't know. I don't know. I just... I want it out of my head. I want it to stop. Okay. And you're gonna stop it. And if I do not? Then we delete you and destroy every bit of your precious research. Then please, allow me to assist you. And we're supposed to just trust your good word here? You are free to trust or not trust whomever you like. But tell me something. Your mother and the Hive, did she resist? Of course she did. So I feared. Young Mira needed no such crude incorporation. Niles, tell me something. My grandfather. Who was he? One of my best geneticists. He fled with little Reyna because he no longer believed in our work. Did Mira know where he took her? I told Mira Reyna had perished in the escape attempt. I assumed that would end the matter. I greatly miscalculated. try to maintain the integrity of my tour. I do this so rarely. So I wasn't right, but I was right. <laughs> By 
But it appears we have another malfunction. Perhaps you could address it? Right. Well, that's probably bad. Your little friend is quite handy. Hey, watch it. Check spoke. Well, you do make a lovely couple. <laughs> our tour almost there now I'm curious how does it feel to have your life's work turn on you I choose to view it differently the locust longed for independence mirror showed them the way I have always been proud of your grandmother I still am this way please Is that thing? The matriarch was generated from your grandmother's stem cells and sire DNA. She amplified Mira's ability to communicate with the locust. This device is where Mira first learned to control her power, but we can also use it to sever your link, if you choose. So how does it work? By mildly damaging your brain. What? By mildly damaging her brain? Her connection to the locust is based on a genetic algorithm inside her temporal lobe. Altering that requires anesthesia, you could say. Sounds like a lobotomy. A lobotomy is highly invasive. This is directed. While I work, the matriarch will guide your mind, undetected, to where it must go. Okay, all right. No, 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 no. You are not doing this. I do not trust this can. Then watch him. But I have to do this. I'm losing control. I won't hurt anyone else, understood? Understood.
seconds. Hey, Kate, I'm here. I'm here. I'm sure that's not going to be a problem. Freeing the matriarch was unwise. You will die. Which means you will never look upon the grandeur of your mother. Transfigured. I'm going to kill you, Niles! Niles is talking about? Later, after we deal with Niles. Every child needs a playmate. Have fun. No? See it, I see it! Uh. Let's take him down! More locusts! Let's 
Oh, dang. I think I'm just gonna whip the pipe out and see how. See how that works. You wanna tell me what the hell Niles is talking about? Later, after we deal with Niles. Every child needs a playmate. Have fun. Del? See it, I see it! Let's take him down! Jack, shock trap! Sweet! Watch it! More locusts! I don't hate the pipe. It's locked. There's got to be a way to open it. Jack, see where that leads. Okay, more locusts are coming. Then hold them off. Hey, Jack, don't take your time on this. Throwing frag. <laughs> Good, but we can't 
leave yet. I'm not letting these things live. All right, then let's finish them off. Let's get after Niles. Keep after Niles. Come on. Hey, Niles, we're still coming. I really don't think he's here. I really don't care. Let's get this open.
Tell. Niles is leaking something. Looks like he went this way. What has been done cannot be undone. This planet is now theirs. Oh, this is bad. I told you I'd get you. Look out! I wonder if Jack's flash freeze will work on it.
again! Okay, then maybe she'll, I don't know, I mean, help us somehow. She would, if she could. But she's not my mother anymore. Then who is she? Their queen. Come on, time to get out of here. got their queen. And Nas is right about what happens next. We need a new plan. No, we need the old plan. We need the Hammer of Dawn. Oh, thank God. Looks like you need a ride. How'd you find us? You think I'm gonna give you a one-of-a-kind piece of tech without the ability to track it to the center of the planet? <laughs> yeah, yeah, fine. And speaking of one-of-a-kinds, help me hook up this skip. You find what you're looking for? Yeah. And now we need to kill it. Is she, you know, all right? Not really. But let me ask you something. How long would it take to get the Hammer of Dawn up and running? Funny you should ask. The data drive you found months ago about the UIR. Yeah? Interesting stuff. Interesting how? You'll see. And lucky for us, I have an old UIR contact. Take us home, Sam. Got it, sweet cheeks. <laughs> <laughs> 